The beauty hacks by celebrities you can use in your daily life. Coming up, skin and beauty expert Linda Moore shares some of her faves. From using metal spoons to toilet seat covers, not as intended, celebrities have some weird and wacky sounding beauty hacks, but we can actually use them. Skin and beauty expert Linda Moore joins us with some of her faves. Good morning. Good morning to you. Okay, these are wild, but let's start with um, the, the spoon. Okay, well here's the spoon and it's cold. It was in my freezer. Oh. And this is great if you're traveling and you forget your eyelash curler. Mm. Um, put this on your lid. This, this way. way. Yeah, this way. And just bring your lashes up. Oh my gosh, that's so cold. Yeah, and just hold for about 10 seconds or so. Okay. And then your lashes will stay curly and you don't need the, you know, eyelash curler. Do you have and to put stick this in the freezer first? You could in the freezer or the refrigerator, okay. but you do want it nice and cold. Cold, okay. Mm -hmm. All right, what else you got? So mascara. Now I hate when I put on mascara and I notice that my mascara is dry. Yes, and then the like clumps fall onto your cheek yes. and then you try to wipe them away and you get a streak. <laughs> it's, a, it's, it's a process. It's a hot mess, yes. <laughs> so add saline solution. Okay to your mascara, so just add a few drops mm -hmm. and then shake it up and you get about a week's worth of mascara. Nice. Yes, and saline solution is great because it's safe for the eye area yes. and it's been tested. So. Yeah, if you're not a contact wearer, that's just contact solution, right? It's contact solution. Perfect. Yeah, and you could just get a little travel size if you don't have yeah. it. Yeah. Yeah, so okay. I love that. And this, I've got the same exact <laughs> huge thing of coconut oil at home. Yes. What are you using Well, I for? use this for baking, I use this for frying and then I also use it um, just like celebrities do to remove makeup so oh. this is a great hack now oil does tend to re, you know react with the oil in your skin so it removes makeup wonderfully okay but you just you do need to wash it off now a lot of people mm. there was a TikTok about a, a coconut oil as a moisturizer and I don't recommend that because coconut oil can be a little clogging on the skin okay so you do want to use it to remove makeup it's great it'll just just make that makeup just slide off. Okay. Yeah. But wash it off. And your then face wash after. it off with your cleanser. Yes. Okay. What about moisturizer for like hands where you're not worried about your pores for clogging? For hands or feet, I feel like it's okay. okay. But definitely not for the face. You can okay. use it on your hair. It's a great conditioner oh. for your hair as well. Yeah. Okay. And then what else do you have right here? Now this is also a little. Uh, D I D Y. What is it? D I Y. Okay. Um, a famous model uses this to condition her lashes. She uses coconut oil, castor oil, and a little bit of lavender. What? And then just take a spoolie brush and then apply it onto your lashes. Yeah, it's a great lash serum. I know lash serums can be very expensive. Yes. So the oils, the castor oil, and the coconut oil will help strengthen the lashes. Wow. I'd never thought about that. Okay. And this is my you favorite. Have a toilet seat cover here. Yes. Yes, aren't those beautiful? They're <laughs> it's gorgeous. <laughs> I stole them from the bathroom here. Wonderful. Now, they're a great absorbent paper. I mean, that's okay. what it is. It's absorbent paper, and so they're great to remove oil. That's okay. excess oil on the skin. So now I did my makeup at 6:30 this morning. So we're gonna see if we can see a difference. I get oily here on my nose. Yeah. And then a little here on my forehead. Yeah. Now oh, when yeah. you're at a restaurant, you don't want to whip out this big toilet seat cover. No, that would no, be embarrassing. That would be, so just take a little piece off and okay. then yeah put it in your purse and then use it throughout the night okay good to know um, ice ice you know I talk about ice I think all the time because it's one of my favorite but it really does when you apply ice to the face it'll help stimulate the blood flow it'll help re reduce puffiness of okay. the eyes okay. it's hydrating it helps to build Ooh. collagen in the skin I mean it's just one of those beauty hacks that I love and it's free you know everyone yeah. has ice yeah okay it's a little miracle uh, thing it's from your freezer. Definitely. Avocado. So this right here is actually a recipe for avocado and your conditioner and you mix that and you apply it onto your hair and you leave it on for about 30 minutes. I know you're complimenting me. Yeah, on my, my I know. Hair. Your hair is so like <laughs> sleek and smooth and beautiful. Yes, and it's avocado and conditioner. Wow. And you can get these little samples at Ulta or any of your beauty supply places or beauty salons mm -hmm. and ask for a sample and then mix it with your avocado that's about to go bad. How much <laughs> avocado are we talking? Like the whole just, thing? No, I just use about half of the avocado. Half the yeah. avocado a, with a sample. Yes. Put it in, leave put it, it on in. for about 30 minutes. Oh my gosh. Yeah, and that's your mask. That's your 
hair mask. You know what? All of these will save you money and make you look good. Thank you, Linda. You're welcome. All right, Jace. I don't know. I'm staying far away from castor oil. That's what, that's what Spanky and Alfalfa had to, had to drink when they got in trouble. Oh, well, don't drink it. No, okay, just put it on your eyelashes. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thanks, guys.